and we've not been able to find the rock pool so we're about to launch the drone to see if we can find it And today the sun is out like today the weather looks good i wish it was like this yesterday because it just messed up our plans yesterday anyways today we're going to saint Anne marine park for snorkeling so um, we've had breakfast already and all of that we are ready so we'll be leaving the hotel shortly and i'll let you guys know how everything goes i'll let you see when we get there and all of that i think we'll be going to another place from there i've forgotten the name of the place but when we get there i'll let you guys know so yeah hopefully the weather stays this way till tomorrow because tomorrow is our last day here and at least so that we can get some things done because we leave like um around five so if the weather is good i don't even understand why it rained yesterday to be fair but yeah we move so i'll let you guys know how everything goes and i'll let you see when we get there the sun is so out today and i still don't understand why it rained yesterday like this should have been yesterday so we get my you know scuba diving and all of this stuff done but it decided to rain yesterday like yesterday was just a rainy day it rained from morning till like late afternoon because it was drizzling and all of that and so we couldn't do any water activity because they said the obviously the the sea was rough so there was no point going snorkeling scuba diving and all of that so we couldn't do any of that yesterday so today we're going to do snorkeling the plan was to do scuba diving yesterday then today we go up to ladig good morning fine thank you thank you thank you <laughs> guys so our hotel actually has a lot of you know charging points for electric cars so once you get back to the hotel you put your car back on charge for the next day this is so cool I'm kind of new with apologies Holding back, I got history guys so this is going to be like a five hour cruise on this catamaran so we're cruising to um saint anne marine park where we would have snorkeling so when we get to saint anne marine park 
and um, it will just stop for us to have like um, 45 minutes snorkeling and then from there we cruise to Mwayan Island where we would have you know a tour of the place and then we just chill on the island and have lunch and from there we cruise back to St. Anne Marine Park for another 45 minutes of snorkeling before we head back. So we're finally at St. Anne Marine Park for snorkeling and I'm just, you know, getting my snorkeling gear on. And it's so funny how, you know, I feel so comfortable when I'm swimming in the pool. But whenever I have to swim, like in the sea or in the ocean, I panic, like I panic so much. And so I always need my life jacket on. So yeah, that's just me. I don't know why, but I think I need to work on it. I don't know why you make me wanna do better We're done with snorkeling and we'll be going on this um, small speed boat to Mwayan Island. So we'll be going in batches onto the island for the Mwayan Island tour and also to have lunch and just chill on the island. I'm telling you that there ain't no other way. Pack your bags and then you will go away. I'm not gonna be begging you to stay. Today, I would handle this shit differently. Things are different, I'm a new me. That's not gonna happen. That's not gonna happen. That's not, that's not gonna happen. So, even if you're asking, even, even if you're asking, cause I do what I do, and it's time for something new. Yeah. Now there's nothing here for me 
back to St. Anne Marine Park for another 45 minutes of snorkeling but this time around I ain't going into the water no way so I'm just going to um, relax like on the catamaran and take some drone shots with Habi and all of that yeah <laughs> Hey guys, so it's another morning and all too soon our Seychelles trip is coming to an end. Today is our last day in Seychelles and yesterday hmm, we did a lot of walking like that's Moyen Island or whatever like we had to do a lot of walking here like I was so tired I was so so tired and we spent the whole day we got back to the hotel like um, say after six so the initial plan was for us to go scuba diving this morning but looking at the way i was tired i knew i wouldn't be able to wake up so early because with the scuba diving we had to wake up like maybe five because pickup time was six and i knew i was not up for it so we cancelled the scuba diving and so today what we're going to do is we're going to go to the rock pool wanted to do that on sunday Day. yeah we wanted to do that on sunday but then obviously they said everything was closed and then on monday too because it rained we couldn't no was it monday yeah on monday because it rained we couldn't go there so we're going to go there today and then from there we'll go into the town as in the capital city to victoria so we couldn't go to ladig unfortunately so yeah probably i'll come on another trip to seychelles and try and go to ladig because i would love to see you know those nice beaches at ladig and apparently in ladig it's you know more laid back more chilled vibes as compared to mahi island so yeah um that's what we'll be up to today and then from there we'll head to the airport so we're just getting ready to go have breakfast and from there we'll just check out and put like our bags in the car because we have like a rented car we would use the car to do our rounds then from there we'll just drop the car off at the airport and then we go check in and leave seychelles but yeah it's actually been a very chilled trip i i won't lie it's been a very chilled trip and 
this place is beautiful trust me this place is beautiful so yeah i'm just about to go finish up packing then we would go have breakfast check out leave the hotel and continue with the rest of our activities so yeah i'll keep you guys posted as always i know i want to take my flowers along but i don't know how i'm going to do that because yeah i want to take my flowers with me because they are still fresh very 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 fresh so i don't take them along i think i'll just hold it as we board like i'll just carry it with me i'll just carry it with me i just hope they'll be able to make it to ghana but yeah so um these are roses right and then they have three different colors so after i got the flowers what happy told me was each color represents um what's it called each color represents a year of my life on earth right so i have three as it orange or yellow <laughs> three orange or yellow roses three pink roses and then three white roses making it you know 30 so three different colors to represent my 30 years on earth and i love it so yeah i try to see if i can carry them along with me because i really do want to take this with me all right guys so let me quickly go take my bath go have breakfast check out and we'll go on with the rest of our day guys so we are all packed now i have my flowers with me and see so we're just going to pack the things into the car go have breakfast and then you know get on with the rest of the activities and head to the airport from there our flight is for 5 p.m so yeah hopefully we'll be able to do all of that before um our flight yeah So extra, but I know I'm the same. Love me in spite of my trauma. Give me what I need instead of the drama. Cause when it pop off, it's like, oh my, all good all day, but the night we be going so hard on the flip side. So tell me, we'll be on a day, babe. I could keep that same energy. When you go low, I go low too. But you'd rather stay high, I know. Can we stay high, babe? I'd rather be on that way Tryna control our emotions If we on a rise out of passion We could share love in the ocean But if you wanna go insane either way, baby We could go all night We could do it all night We could go all night Do we heal, do we bleed? I'ma follow like, your lead, but we could go Calls go to voicemail I block you so I don't raise hell Should the talk through it in detail A separate ways ain't gon' end well Alright guys, so we just finished having breakfast and we're just leaving the hotel. This hotel looks so huge, trust me. From the main gate to the property itself, it's such a distance. So we're now driving from the property to the main gate. I know I actually filmed like a separate video to show you around the hotel. So look forward to a Kempinski um, Seychelles hotel video or like a hotel review or whatever. Um, yes, yeah, so I'll upload that after my Seychelles vlog. So yeah, it's bye bye Kempinski, and I really had a good time here. It's such a lovely place, and I don't regret choosing to stay here. Okay, I'm admitting that a couple things I said got a city in the town, and the presence I get careless. 
Long as you know I come with imperfections When you look at me, you see the soul through my flesh You something special Know you looking bomb, the way you dress it gone Flex it, hold it still and let my mind digest You got the leverage, you got the upper handle on the situation You worthy of a million more of the storms that we weather We fight retreating, then fuck, but you trying to kill the cycle When nobody stressing that body like me, I know the way you like it I treat you like a queen, run the castle, you a treasure Feel like you setting fire to my desire for the pleasure You a gem, got me blim, let's make amends Know you can't, I'm out here Trying to control our emotions We on the rise out of passion Can share love in the ocean But you wanna go insane either way, baby, we could go Guys, so we just got to the rock pool access and it's actually beside um Chef's Batista Villa. I actually came across that particular hotel when we we're looking for you know a place to stay in in Seychelles. So we're going to go on an adventure because we're doing this on our own without any wow, beware of dogs without any tour guide. And I don't know, this is going to be such a journey but yeah let's do this Guys, this journey is not an easy one. We've been walking for the past 30 minutes and we've not been able to find the rock pool. So we're about to launch the drone to see if we can find it, like locate the rock pool. And then we go there, but apparently we are actually close, but we just can't find it. So yeah. guys so we've been able to locate the rock pool thanks to the drone so now we have to find our way down there to the rock pool this has been i don't know one hell of a trip but yeah i'm glad we finally found the rock pool because at some point i almost gave up i was like you know what let's just get back because my husband was not even up for this but you know baby girl wanted to see the rock pool <laughs> so it's around 10 30 a.m now and obviously the tides are really high around this time so when you come here around this time you can't get into the rock pool um i hear it's advisable to come here like after 12 because around that time mostly the tides are you know low and you can swim in the rock pool but obviously for us because we are leaving seychelles today and our flight is for like later in the day we had no other option than to come around this time but at least i'm glad that i've been able to see the rock pool so if you're ever in seychelles and you want to you know visit the rock pool and you have intentions of swimming then it's better you come like after um 12 because around that time um, the tides will be low and it will be you know ideal for you and very safe so yeah We're going to Victoria now and I'll take you guys along. Where are you? Where are you? Where are you? Where are you? 
It's the end of the weekend But I still wanna turn up Yeah, I still wanna turn up All I want is to go again But you ain't picking your phone up Why you messing my head up? Any night, any day Let me take you away All I need is just saying yeah, 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 yeah Better nights, better days When you're here with me, babe Cause you're all that I crave So I wonder So this is the famous clock tower in Victoria, um, which is the capital of Seychelles. It's actually located like in the center of the capital and um, Victoria is actually the smallest capital in the whole world, like the smallest capital city in the whole world. And we also came up across this um, Hindu temple. So we just stopped by to take, you know, a couple of pictures and videos. I like the whole, you know, architecture thing going on over there. And it's so nice, but we couldn't go inside. And uh, right beside the, the temple there was like a church and it's quite amazing like right beside the temple there's another church and so yeah we just drove through the town and we're also looking for you know all of these um, souvenir shops to actually get fridge magnets because whenever we travel we buy like fridge magnets from uh, like that particular destination and I quite remember somebody once asked me what do I collect I guess it's safe to say now that I collect you know fridge magnets and probably currencies so yeah we finally found a shop and we're just going through you know the stuff they have to see which fridge magnets we want to get all right guys so we are off to the airport now to check in and catch our flights we're actually going to spend um, a night in kenya before we head back to ghana and so it's bye bye Seychelles and I hope you guys enjoyed being on this trip with me as much as I did. I'm telling you that there ain't no other way. Pack your bags and then you will go away. I'm not gonna be begging you to stay. Say maybe if you asked me yesterday, I would handle this shit differently. Things are different, I'm a new me. That's not gonna happen. That's not gonna happen. That's not gonna happen, so even if you're asking, even, even if you're asking